I love saying that I make socially confirmed scenes. People dancing, people eating, people kissing, and people having a conversation. And for me, all these scenes are invented. Painting and drawing becomes one. Whether I'm using a brush with charcoal or whether I'm using a brush with ink, it's painting or drawing. So the two, for me, have a link. I work on many layers at the same time, but I have to wait for the painting to dry in a way for me to be able to work on the next layer. In a way, I have a relationship with the painting. It tells me what to do. It says, stop, continue, stop. This is fine, this is okay, continue. Most of these characters in the paintings are kind of immersed in themselves. They are in the painting, but they are in their own world. It leaves room for imagination. I'm coming in, into the studio and looking at the painting. I start thinking myself, hey, what actually happened before uh, the scene and what's going to happen afterwards in the scene? And for me, uh, that moment of existence is a powerful moment. I chose to make work that reflects about ideas such as love, relationships, intimacy, temptation, in a way trying to document or trying to write notes about the experiences that people have within their conversational situations. And most importantly, the project is an archive. It's an archive on, you could say, black love. No matter the political landscape, people do not stop living their lives. And this is what I'm doing in my paintings. I'm grasping the concept of life. I'm trying to represent these people, these characters, these people of color in all forms of humanity.